Hello everybody and welcome once again to The Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past Randomized. I am Gary of the Misinformed Brothers and you've tuned in to episode 2. And last we left off we were in Sriracha Saucer's house and I was going to head to the Eastern Palace. At least I think it's called the Eastern Palace or is it called the Eastern Temple? I can't remember. Edit and Gary will sort that out. Do that. Thanks mate. Right, so just head straight on over to the Eastern Palace. I think it's the Eastern Palace, I can't quite remember. This, I don't know why, maybe because I think of it as a temple. I'm sure it's the Eastern Palace. Anyway, I digress. So, make our way through the, through the courtyard area. Try and avoid as many of these battles as I can, just so I can get to the temple. And, yeah. As you may have noticed with this ROM as well, is that... The rupees, they don't finish at 999 anymore, they go straight up to 9,999. So at least I don't have to worry about collecting too much money and wasting it whenever I open a random chest. Now, which way is it? Free. Uh, left. I think it's left. Let's try left. Yeah, I think it's left. Nope, wrong. Okay. Must be right. I'm sure it's right. I'm sure there's a way you have to go before you head up the middle. Let me just stop running into walls. No, no. Okay, well, third time's the charm. <laughs> Must be the middle. Head on over and kill these guys before opening that door. Get a little bit more money. And the ballroom. Quick, 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 quick. Avoid, get in there, avoid the big ball that I know is about to come. There we go. Uh, well, sick dodge. Right, now. That's the that's the room with the master chest in. I'm gonna go left here. I'm gonna go left first. I'm sure that's the smartest way to go now. Ah, I, fucking, I forgot about the fucking hate the jumping bastards. Just gotta pin them in a the corner. You can't even stun them with the boomerang. Oh, fucker. Alright. I'm just. I could have just avoided these guys. Anyway, right. Straight on into this room. Oh, yes, I remember this. You could pop up, kill them with the bottles. Oh, try not to miss. Five bottles for four skeletons. No, I never thought to ever find it strange that the part deals more damage than the sword. Oh, another chest. What's in here? Ah, oh, the map. Excellent. Now, if I could just remember which button it is to open the map. There we go. Okay. There's a few rooms to go. Make sure to check them all, just in case, so I don't miss a, uh, any chests anywhere. Now, this is the master key chest. I don't have the master key yet, but I don't know. We'll see if it works. You need the master key, dumbass. Okay, thank you. Get that guy out of my way. Yeah. Right. I think there's a chest in here. No, no, I'm completely wrong. Yeah, I'm thinking of another room. <clears throat> Make my way around here, head all the way back around after opening that door. It's a good job you don't need the the guys who program this ROM decided to make it so you don't need the lantern to light your way in the, in dark rooms. Otherwise, you'd be totally screwed. Where's the damn key? Otherwise you'd be totally screwed trying to get through the first dungeon and and the part where you rescue Zelda without the lantern. Nah, I opened that chest and I got one rupee. That was ridiculous. Turn over. Let's see what's Ah yes. Yeah, this is the room usually where you'd find the master key. And now I've gotta kill everything. Make these, uh, what are they called? Anti-fairies. 
Make the anti fairies fly around the room. Oh, fuck you. Here you go, have a pot. Mm. Make the end. Uh, now press a switch under here. Um. The fire rod! Brilliant! Fuck me! Well, that's usually the item you get in the second to last dungeon. Well, at least I can uh, light up uh, torches now so I can see. And I can't go through that door. Which would have made things faster. As that leads you back to the master key room. Uh, the master chest room. The main dungeon item in a minute. Well, that was lucky. Just missed that anti fairy. Anyway, okay. Well, lots of backtracking. Back down these stairs and across this room. Okay, right. I'll have to go back to the. I'll have to go back to the front of the temple. So I can head right instead of left. Yeah, right instead of left. And see, uh, see if I can find the master key on that side. It's annoying that you every time you step into this room, you have to kill these skeletons. There's no avoiding them. At least I can dodge these fuckers. Oh, get out of my way. Right. Try and find a heart container. A uh, heart. There we go. Right. Okay, avoid all the skeletons. Get out of Where's the switch? Come on. Not that one. Not the middle one. The first one I tried. It's so annoying that the sprint button is also the pickup button. Like, you could stand in front of a pot just tapping your feet on. Ah, oh, yes, the master key. Brilliant. Good, 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 good. Now I can go and see what's in the main chest. I am hoping too much that it's going to be the actual item that it's supposed to be. There's no way it will be. But we'll find out. Again, I just wish there was a fast way into the room. But, now if I remember, there was a chest on the right-hand side of this room as I came in. How do I get to it? Oh, well, the stairs there. Okay, so, oh, right. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Oh, fuck. Right, well, okay, so... Head on over there, and that's ah, the compass. Well, that's useless. I've opened. That's the last chest in the dungeon. All right. And I, I think, I think that is where the map and the compass usually are. So maybe they've left those in the in the chests that they're supposed to be in. I wonder. I wonder if that's been done on purpose. Anyway, we get past these fuckers. Back in this fucking room where I've got to kill them. Ha! That was the one I meant to get. And you. Ha! There we go. Right. Straight through. See what this master chest has got. Right. Yep. The only other rooms to go in are the boss rooms now. So let's see what this chest holds. Twenty fucking ru are you fucking serious? All that for twenty rupees. Ah oh, fuck. <laughs> Oh, that sucks. I'll eat a fairy or two. Let's see what the boss rooms hold for me. I don't think there's any more chests in these rooms. But we'll see. Where are these green guys? Up, up, up. Where'd the other one go? Okay. 
sure it's one of those holding the key. Ten arrows. Ah, yes, I was right. Okay. Hold on. Isn't there a red one of those? There's a, there's a red one, if I remember rightly. Can you kill the red one with the pots? Or do you need the bow and arrow for that? I don't quite remember. Okay, well, we'll find out, I guess. Oh, oh fuck! <laughs> that damn sprint button again. Fuck him. <laughs> Alright, fuck. Nope, it's the other one. There we go. Yeah, there's the red guy. Can I can I kill him with a pot? Right, let's find out. Oh! Did I miss? It looked like I missed. Come on, wake up. Oh, fuck, no. No, I can't do it with a pot. Can I do it with the fire rod, though? I'm not usually supposed to have it now. Surely this would kill him. Nope, nope. Okay, well. Oh, well, fuck, I can't do this dungeon. Shit. Now where am I supposed to go? I can't do the second dungeon because I don't have the Book of Medora, which is what it was called, as it turns out. And I can't do the third dungeon because I need the moon pearl and the mirror for that. So I think I'm stuck with going over the overworld and finding chests chests in the overworld. And okay. Well, it would certainly help if there was a fast way out of here. And eat another fairy and two. Well, actually, there's that. There was that master key room. Yeah, there was the 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 room that's usually got the master key, and that had a door in it. Does that? I think it leads straight to that hallway in between. But maybe there's another room. I don't know. I want to check it. I don't. I don't want to get leave the chance of leaving anything behind. I want to make sure I get every chest. Let's see. What's through this door? Nope. I was right. I was right, and I was wrong to do this. I've just wasted everyone's time. Sorry, everyone. Okay. Well, I'll head my way out of here. Just wish there was a fast way out. Wait. Hold on, while I'm thinking, is it, okay, while I'm thinking, is it the mirror, or is it the ocarina, if I could just remember the buttons for this pad, mirror or the ocarina that teleports you out? Hmm. Okay, there's only one way to find out. Nope, it's the mirror. Okay. There's another waste of time. Oh, fuck these skeletons. I know. E fire. Ah, missed. There we go. Out of magic, dumbass. Okay. Now, if I could just get my way out of this temple. Get my, cup, get my bow and arrow back. Once I figure out this controller. Out of my way. It's almost out. I always found the music in the dungeons is just. Music in the dungeons has always put me on edge. I've always found it scary. Maybe that's another reason why I've never been able to complete this game. Oh no, yeah, that's it. I've just remembered where the fire rod comes from. It's not the second to last dungeon. You get the fire rod to fight the moth in Skull Woods. 
which is the tent which is the dungeon which I always fucking hated, especially fighting the muff. I fucking hate that battle. And I'll look forward to recording that for you all, because it's just an absolute fucking nightmare of a boss to fight. Anyway. Right, I think I'm gonna head to the Zora. I'm gonna head to the Zora. The area with the Zoras are I'm gonna see what happens if I try to buy the flippers. Because I already have the flippers, so surely she will give me something else. Gosh, gotta go straight north from here. Watch the uh, Octocrocs spitting stones. Try not to slam into too many walls. Oh, fuck. Come on. Oh, come on, Gary. Don't die. Don't die, Gary. There we go. Right. Well, at least the witch's hut is over here where I can get a free sample of the life potion. <clears throat> Hello, young man. Do you want to try my juice? It's tasty. Oh, yeah. Uh, thank you. Thank you very much. Right. Now. Ah, oh, fuck. I need the power glove, or the titan's mitt, whichever comes first. Mm, if I jump in the water here, can I swim there? Oh, wait. The fairy fountain. Where? where I'm sure it's this way somewhere. The fa Where's the fairy fountain where you throw your shield and your boomerang in? Nope. Not there. I'm sure it's one that's free. Is it? Is it that one? I can't quite remember where it is. Well, it's not that one. Mm, I think it's closer to the Zora area. Come on, like. Closer to the Zora area. Where the where you find the fairy fountain. Right. Oh, well, fuck. I can't get to that area. Not by swimming or with the glove. That sucks. Okay, well, I think I'll head to Kakariko Village and get my uh, avian ally. Or maybe, maybe I'll be able to fly to the Zora area using him. I don't know. We'll find out. I can't quite remember and I'll need the bed to find that out. But, what's in this cave? Uh, oh, yeah, okay, I remember how to get in there. It also sounds like it's just a fairy fountain, but I'll check to make sure there's no chests in there. Yeah, I think it's just a fairy fountain. Yes, hello fairy. Give me back my magic. Thank you very much. Oh wait, can you get fairies out of these small pools? Nope. Wouldn't know what I'd do with it if I did. I don't have the bug net yet. Right. Okay, so straight to Kakariko Village, get the bed, and then I'll see what I can do from there. At least I've got the boots. At least that makes uh, getting across the overworld a bit more faster. Right. Straight to the bed. Sick tunes, Link. And there's my buddy. Okay. There he goes. Now, can I get to this area with the Zoras? Right. Ah, no. No, the closest I can get is the potion shop. But I can get to Mount Doom, and I can get to the desert. Okay. Well, I can get to Mount Doom, that's okay, but I don't want to die. I haven't got time for that in this episode because my timer is just about to start to go off. 
So, I think I'm going to leave you all here in Kakariko Village. And, uh, and I'll, we'll see what happens next time. Thank you all for watching. Please, if you like this video, hit the, uh, hit the like button. And if you want to see more from me or any of uh, the other Misinformed Brothers, then hit the subscribe button. Thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.